Hello, I'm Ryan Frank Mars. Southern Methodist University in, I think it's, it's in Dallas. They're uh, preventing a 9-11 memorial display from being erected in a prominent campus area. Governor Abbott is trying to get them to change that, but I don't want to listen. The first time since 2010, Southern Methodist University is prohibiting a memorial display honoring those who lost their lives on 9 11 from being erected in a prominent campus area. And they claim to be a Christian university, so goes that night notion. Right there, you've uh, demonstrated that you are apostate. I'm an agnostic, by the way. As some of you administrators saying, allowing the display on a centrally located Dallas Town Hall, Dallas Hall Lawn, which is where it has been for several years, will be in violation of a new policy in the state the school respects the rights of all members of the academic community to be free from coercion and harassment. Bullshit! That is incredible bullshit. People lost their lives on that day. Reasonable limitations have been placed on time, place, and manner you know, of such expression activities in order to serve the interests of health and safety, prevent interference from the conduct of university business, and protect against the infringement of rights of others. So, now what? Blowing up skyscrapers and killing people is a civil right? These people are out of their minds. The memorial consists of nearly 3,000 flags for every life lost in the 2001 attack, and sign that says Young Americans for Freedom. Name of the student group that sets up the display, as well as the sign that says 9 11 Never Forget. Members of Young Americans for Freedom say they're shocked that SMU views the memorial as political or potentially offensive to some people. I don't give a shit if it is. Reasonable limitations may be placed on the time, place, and manner of such expression activities in order to serve the interests of health and safety, prevent the interference in the conduct of university business, and protect against the infringement of the rights of others. We are confused and flabbergasted of Whitney Babin, a member of college Republicans and Young Americans for Freedom, Fox News. September 11th is a fact. It happened. Something that happened. Last year we had a memorial service where we raised our flag. Somebody played taps. It's not a controversial thing. We're so shocked. Yeah, I can imagine you are. I'm pissed. Artifacts is angry. Alright. Universally, officials say they didn't respect the concept of the memorial for September 11th, but not all activities that fall under the new policy on lawn displays, among other things, are being affected. The new policy on lawn displays requires them to move to another spot on campus that soon groups say is remote, almost hidden. In other words, screw 9 11. Who cares? It's a minor footnote in history. They say they're not singling out young Americans for freedom of display and that they're committed to respecting free speech. That is a lie. You are a liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. New policy applies to all one displays as Kent Best spokesman for SMU. SMU moved all lawn displays from the previous location for a portion, a portion of Dallas Hall lawn. In addition to raising concerns about offensive and coercive messages, SMU officials also attributed their denial of the September 11th memorial display on the main campus to logistics. Dallas Hall Lawn, best son, is used by campus community members as a place for 
setting out door classes and variety of university events throughout the year. Too bad. That's just an excuse to students like Grant Wu and Chairman and Father of the Chapter of the Young Americans for Freedom. Their policy made a statement about writing messages and such and they're respecting free speech but right to avoid it. These are diametrically opposed. Well, Grant, I agree with you. This is ludicrous. Uh, you see why I've become an agnostic? This is this type of thing is one of the contributing factors to that. This is supposed to be a Christian university. They're supposed to stand for something. But they're not Christian. These are commie liberals. There's little difference between SMU and Harvard, Yale, Ole Miss, what have you. There's little difference. These are commie liberals. They hate America. They hate freedom. They hate the First Amendment. Disgusting and abhorred. You ought to be ashamed of yourselves. I am out of facts of Mars. If I go much longer, I'm going to start screaming, so I better stop. Thanks for watching.